Hey everybody, <clears throat> it's Bagel DR Buster here. Uh, got a couple things I want to show you. Um, got a package in the mail today when I got home, sitting on the porch. Uh, just want to share it with you guys, and uh, I'll get to that here in a second. But I uh, asked Sendall Piper, Sendall Pipes on uh, Instagram, what would be the best Frog and Mortis to buy, and um, I had a lot of replies. A lot of other people chimed in, but. Um, he mentioned, or someone else mentioned on the thread, um, to try a Frog Morton Cellar. So, I went and got some, and uh, I can't wait to try it. So, anyway, that's my Frog Morton Cellar. I'll try it, and uh, I'll attach my reaction to this this uh, this video too. So, anyway, I'm glad you guys could share with me in that. Um, excited about trying it. So, and now I'm going to open my box. Uh, won a few things off eBay here lately, and um, I have a feeling I know what it is, but um, you can see here, the bay, the eBay, so we'll open it up and see what we got. I think I, I, I know what it is, so I think I do. Um... My dogs are down here sniffing the box. So they're curious to see what it is also. What's up? A lot of paper. Shredded paper. Oh yeah. This is a, it's a wrapped in cellophane, but it's a vintage uh, pipe rack. Holds 12 pipes. Um, Decatur Industries is who makes it. Do you see that there? Uh, I was just running out of, out of space. For some of my pipes, or actually for all my pipes, I have a few laying on the dresser here and there. And we wanted wanted to get something where I could kind of display them all together, and uh, you know, just be a little neat, tidy up the place a little bit. So. You know what? Let's take my knife here. And just slice her open. This is cool. You can see the vintage uh, wear in it, or the wear in it, to make it uh, make it look real vintage. Yeah, a lot of these people had had dogs. You can I say dog here on the, on the bottom of it. So uh, anyway, here's the here's the uh, the sticker. Decatur Industries. Um, it's got. A gold gold painted uh, columns here. It's going to hold twelve pipes. Um, you can see the wear down in the uh, in the grooves down there, which I think looks pretty cool. I like kind of worn things, you know, vintage, um, distressed look. So anyway, just want to share that with you guys. And um, hopefully when I fill this thing up, I'll show you what it looks like. So anyway, um, going to have a little birthday dinner with my wife. Uh, it's her birthday today. So um, then we're going to have some cake and ice cream. And then I'll smoke my Frog Mortons and I'll let you guys know what I think about it. See you guys. All right, fellas uh, and ladies, I guess. Going to go ahead and uh, <clears throat> kind of give my review on the Frog Mortons. I'll go ahead and tell you, I kind of cheated a little bit. I um, went ahead and opened it. <laughs> I wasn't thinking, and I opened it. And uh, But I just briefly smelled it. Um, but I can tell you that... Now, I'm from the South, and um, 
down south we love our barbecue and I love barbecue I could eat barbecue every day and I'm telling you first thing I thought when I opened this was that smells like sweet uh, southern barbecue got almost a mesquite barbecue flavor to it you know around here in uh, South Carolina we eat a lot of um, vinegar based barbecue and uh, this almost smells like something you get out in Texas or you know maybe further further west not uh, on the east coast like what we have here but anyway smells fantastic so just wanted to uh, you know light, light me up a bowl and uh, see what I thought about it you know I've heard so many good things about it and um, hearing people rave about it and uh, especially the Dagners and Sandal Pipe uh, when I asked him on, like I said I asked him on Instagram the other day what do you recommend and I think he said he smokes uh, on the bayou and some other uh, somebody else chimed in and uh, said that they preferred cellar so uh, matter of fact a lot of people said cellar so I'm gonna try the cellar and uh, see what I think about it and I got it in my little 7LA 320 here um, I usually save my other pipes for my aromatics and I, I don't really, really want to uh, putting it any, any aromatics in my in this one so we'll go ahead and light it up and see uh, see what I think about it Really can't taste it yet. It doesn't have an aftertaste, uh, as far as I can tell so far. Once I get down to the nitty gritty of it, I can, I'll probably be able to tell. I do like the taste. Yeah, I, like I said, I can taste that kind of a barbecue uh, taste to it. It's really, really smooth. Uh, smoother than what I expected. Not really sure what I expected. You know, I just heard so many people talk, uh, give good reviews of it, talk well about it. I didn't know what to expect. Man, that tastes good. Kind of reminds me of uh, kind of reminds me of um, like being in the woods. It's so smooth. That's amazing. Tastes really good. Um, just a little small update. I got in touch with Drum Piper Eleven, and um, 
<clears throat> just let him know that I was going to send him some of my, uh, my favorite aromatic. Like I said earlier, I think it was in my first video, um, I really enjoy Bob's Wacky Backy from uh, down the road here in Greenville. So, I uh, <laughs> actually had it packaged up and took it to work with me today and was going to stop by the um, post office on the way home. And pulled in the parking lot and noticed there was no, no cars there. And <laughs> got out. And this was like at 4.15. And they closed at 4 o'clock. Hours are... 10 to 4. That's, I mean, if you ask me, that's some st stupid, stupid hour for a government office or, you know, a federal office, but, you know, they'll just take our money and uh, open when they want to, I reckon. Man, that tastes good. There is no bite whatsoever in this. It's so smooth. But anyway, um, someone will mail that out tomorrow to Drum Piper 11. And hopefully he'll uh, see if he likes it. And um, I think he only lives about an hour and 40 minutes from here, so maybe we can get together sometime and uh, smoke a bowl. And uh, you know we'll we'll join forces one time, kind of trade some backy. But anyway, like I said, this is this uh, Frog Morton cellar is very very smooth. Um, I really can't find anything wrong with it. Tastes really good. Man, that tastes good. But, anyway. Happy smoking, guys. Uh, and girls, I guess. You guys uh, comment if you want. Let me know what you think about Frog Morton Cellar. Uh, like I said, this is my first time smoking it. And as soon as I opened up the can, uh, I thought of Southern Barbecue. And I love me some Southern Barbecue. So, you folks take care, and uh, we'll holler at you later. See you.